Well, here's the job I've been putting off for, oh, um, 11 months. Repairing one of the grommets on my 12 by 12 spike tent. So I've got my tent out, and I have this Lord and Hodge grommet repair kit. And I bought some extra grommets from the same company. This is supposed to be the best grommet kit on the market, and these are supposed to be the highest quality brass grommets. So I made sure I got the right size grommets for my tent, what happened was last year I had a buddy of mine up in deer camp helping me break my camp down and while we were taking the side poles off a grommet popped out. Well I thought a grommet popped out that's the way I remembered it but what happened is it looks like the washer came off this one the bottom part. And There's the grommet right there. I need one of these parts this washer replaced. So I'm wondering if I can do that without tearing the whole grommet out. So I've laid out a little workspace here. I got a little throw rug I can kneel on. And you're supposed to uh, place the material on the wooden block, strike cutter with hammer or mallet to make a hole. Well, we've already made a hole. Place grommet post up on the base. Center the hole and material over two. Okay, so there's the existing grommet. Like I said, we only need a washer in this one. So I'm gonna go ahead and open the box. Again, this is a Lord and Hodge Incorporated grommet kit made in Middletown, Connecticut. Now, I did a lot of research because you can buy cheap grommets and you can have a lot of problems. They make the best grommets and correspondingly one of the best kits. So I'll put their little wooden block aside. I know I need that piece there. This piece here. This and a washer. My washers appear to be a little bit larger than the ones on the tent here, so I don't know. If this is gonna work. Looks like it's not gonna work. Yeah, just trying to replace the washer was a bad idea. These are the correct size grommets, but they're obviously manufactured by different companies. So there's gonna be a little variance and it's best just to start with a brand new matching washer and grommet. Okay, so there's the washer rounded side up correct that's rounded and underneath here i've got this tool which is the base and i assume the flat part of the base goes down you put your um, grommet in here with a post up line it up with this tool. Then you put the washer on, rounded side up, line that up. Then you get the insert handle, put it over that, and give it a whack. Oh yeah, I can already tell that worked. I'm going to turn it a quarter turn 
just like they said. Till I go all the way around. Okay. Let's go deer hunting in Idaho. Just as soon as I get this back inside this 